Um, we're given the following math question. The table above gives selected values of a polynomial function p. Based on the values in the table, which of the following must be a factor of p? So whenever we're given this type of polynomial equation, it's always going to refer to an x value, which is the inverse of this little number here. So that's going to be 3 in this situation. And consistently a y value of 0. Now, an x value of 3 isn't even represented in the table in the first place, so it can't be a. Same thing goes with b. There isn't such a thing as x equals to negative 3 on the table, so it can't be a b. There is x is equal to 1 on the table, but the y value doesn't equal to 0. In this situation, it equals to negative 1, and therefore it can't be c. Finally, with b, we do have a negative 1 on the table, and it is equal to 0. And when you look at 2 as well, the y value is also equal to 0, and therefore the answer is d.